Kids and Cadets, welcome back to Tommy Time. Thanks for coming out, checking out my channel. As you recall, about three weeks ago, I got the mother load of lawn mowers from a lawn repair service going out of business. So I ended up with 14 units and I think one pressure washer, all non-runners. I happened to see an ad today for, it looks like, six complete units for 50 bucks. So I wasn't sure if it was $50 each or 50 for the whole unit. I just made arrangements to look at them and then ask questions later. So it ended up being 50 for the whole package deal. So the gentleman said these are all retired lawn service units that the company would just go out and buy a new unit if it broke down and they just stockpiled the non-runners and they finally got rid of them today. There's not one complete unit here <clears throat> like there was on the mother load. So none of these I can just squirt a shot of happy juice and see if they'll start. They're missing, each of them is missing several components. As you can see with this, Bolens is missing the gas cap, the recoil, and the air filter cover. So, moving down the line, this Brute 675, missing the whole handle assembly. <clears throat> Other than that, it looks like a complete unit. We got an older Quantum 2-in-1 combo, the Briggs and Stratton engine. That's an oldie but goodie, missing the rear wheels. Then I have a fantastic Craftsman deck here. It's missing the handle and the engine, but the deck is in superb condition. I can throw, throw an engine on this with the handle. I have a rusty deck candidate. I'll just switch the handle out in the engine onto this great deck and we, we're in business. Do a little switcheroo action. I got a newer Troy built This is missing the handle assembly and the rear wheels. I was trying to find the date code on this Troy built and I don't see it. So let's see if this one's got a blade. Yeah, it's got a blade, so other than the handle, this is a complete unit. This might have some potential. Then we got a, a, a Troy built with a Honda engine. This is missing the handle as well. That would be a good parts candidate. The um, trying to find the date code on this one. Don't see a date code on that one either. And last but not least, we got this Toro with the Kohler engine. 
this one has the handle on it the um, both brake uh, brake cables missing and the front wheel drive cables broken and it's missing the carburetor somebody stuffed a paper towel in the intake to keep water out of it <clears throat> so this will be a a parts candidate I believe the decks showing some rust <clears throat> the transmission would be a good good thing to salvage off of this I'm always looking for transmissions on these Toros appears it hasn't seen much use the tread on the front drive tires is fantastic So this stash of six mowers in the deck, the single deck, will be a good a good addition to my scrap slash junkyard pile. I can pull a ton of stuff off, ton of parts off of these units. Salvage what's left. Lots, lots of stuff is missing, but there's still a lot left that I can utilize. So, quick update on the baby load, I'll call this. Not as many as the mother load, but the baby load, I think, for 50 bucks was a pretty good find today. Anywho, appreciate you coming out and checking out my latest mower grab. I hope you have a great day today. Come back and see me.